Hello and welcome to another video. This is Nikhil here. We are looking at questions for Python Essentials. And uh, here's our problem for today, creating a list of multiples of three. And following that, we will be adding a few additional multiples to that list using the extend command. Let's just say mult list. Create a blank one to begin with using square bracket. And we can use the for loop for i in, let's just say, range. We talk about the first 10 multiples. So we assign p is equal to three times. I and uh, we append this p. Basically, we extend it, or we can we could use append for now, right? We'll come to the extend part later. Is equal to monthless dot append p. So we're basically updating the multiple list itself. We actually don't require this. Okay, a simple command will suffice. It modifies the multiple list. And uh, let's go ahead and print the list following that. We can run this. We have a list of 10 multiples. Basically, we stop at one short of this number here. So you have nine times zero going up to nine, uh, three times zero, going up to three times nine, right? So say we have to extend a few multiples at this point and you are far down in your algorithm. You cannot immediately access this to modify this, right? We do have the mult list or the multiple list at our disposal. So we could simply use the extend command and uh, give the new multiples. So we are having three or five additional multiples, right? 30, 33, 36, 39, and 42, right? Let's see what we have in the updated list. Now you see right where we stopped off, three times nine, we go on from three times 10 to three times 40, right? So the other way would be to merely create, create a new list, new multiples is equal to, we can of course provide another loop here, right? We can provide another loop, specify the list range and give the, give the numbers basically 10 to 14 or 10 to 15. That would provide us the new multiples or we just create this new list directly. And how you would extend mult list is by merely providing the new multiple list within the extend command. You can run this. Try printing to check if the update has taken place. There we see it's happened twice here. We had an existing list, right? Due to this extension. And the second time due to extending with the newly created list. 